the livelihood improvement family enterprises Niger Delta Life ND intervention in Abia State has truly told the conceptual lines of the project by making sure that among the project's target audience, the physically challenged was reached. The state project coordinator, Dr. Uchena Roland Onyezu and his team is putting more effort to get the project running in Abia State. This documentary is a testimony of the impact of Abia Life ND in the life of Emmanuel Anthony Chinazum, a physically challenged Gubeti of the poetry aspect of Life ND project. Emmanuel lives about 7 kilometers from the farm where he is assigned to an incubator. Despite his physical challenge, he makes prompt effort to get to his training center on this deplorable road, even when a commercial means of transport is not on site. Moved by his determination to learn from the agro project, Abia Life ND team took the responsibility to know his background by visiting his home where he lives with his mother, uncle and siblings. Soft-spoken Emmanuel narrates how he knew about the project and what he has acquired so far. I had it from radio, newspaper and the television. Then I went to the school. Since you applied, will you say that you have benefited? Yes. How? Because I have gained much knowledge about how to how to do poetry business. Even all the trainers that I have gone, but I have benefited it. So much. I was trained in financial literacy and business orientation training at home while. I like in the officials they give me transport that I used to they can transport myself by incubation center. Ordina Arome is the farm manager of the incubation center. Yeah, Emmanuel is being trained and he testified that he is a good incubator and a fast learner. Yes, Emmanuel Anthony is one of the physically challenged. He did very well, marvelously well. He has completed the second cycle, he just completed the second cycle of Royal Production and he made a very good profit. Despite the challenges, he was able to compete with other incubators. He did very well overall. Okay. What can you recommend him for any... Sure, sure. He has been able to, to learn the rudiments. He has been able to learn everything that has to do with Braille production. There is no doubt, after this place, Emmanuel can do very well anywhere. Should he have any challenges when he goes back to his own poetry? Will you be able to assist him? Well, the challenge is minimal. I use part of the money to buy some drugs and for my girl was 258,515. Emmanuel really demonstrated his willingness to learn despite his physical challenge. Emmanuel's mother also spoke on how her son enrolled as an Ikubiti for Abia Life ND. <laughs> そう、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、
to expect? We are just beginning, if you ask me. Um, we have a lot to do, we have a lot in our plans, and I um, use this opportunity to ask for uh, continuous cooperation and understanding from all stakeholders within the state to support our project across the state. The Life ND project is being funded by the International Fund for Agricultural Development, IFAD. The project is ongoing in the nine Niger Delta states of Nigeria. Also involved in the project are the Federal Ministry of Agriculture, the Federal Ministry of Finance, Budget, and National Planning, International Fund for Agricultural Development, IFAD, and the United Nations.